y'all welcome back to my channel so today's video is actually going to be a little bit different um i'm actually going to be showing you guys my makeup collection and how like i organize everything um i really didn't know what i wanted to film today but i knew i wanted to film something but i didn't know what and then i was watching a youtube video i was actually watching a makeup collection and i was like why not just show you guys my makeup collection is for like a little video so that is what i'm going to be doing today i'm just going to be showing you guys how i have everything i have everything set up how i organize it and just all my makeup and just a disclaimer i am not bragging about the things that i do have but one of the reasons is i am proud of what i have and i'm very blessed and thankful for what i have and another reason is I don't have that much makeup. I really don't. Just like looking at it and looking through everyone else's videos, I don't have that much. I really don't. I honestly believe I have the lowest amount of makeup compared to a lot of people who make beauty videos on YouTube. But that doesn't stop me from showing you guys what I have because, again, I'm thankful for what I do have. So if you guys want to see how I have everything set up, just keep on watching. Okay, so here is an overview of my makeup setup organization. And there is my dog. You caught a quick glimpse of her. But we are going to get started over here. So this little clear acrylic storage I got from Ross just like last week. It was um, like 20 bucks and I really, really have been looking for one and I have not found one. And then when I saw it, I was just like, I have to have it. So I did. But in this top drawer, I have my ColourPop Ultra Matte Lips. I have those all up in there. And then in this next drawer, I have my Kylie Cosmetic lips. Quite a few. I love them. And then in my third drawer, I don't have much at all. I'm probably not going to leave these in here, but I don't really have anywhere to put them. But these are just like all my lip pencils. So I have those up in there. And then in the bottom drawer, I have my ColourPop collection. I've been going through a phase of loving ColourPop, and which I have. So, but these right here, just like some loose eyeshadows, I just recently got them. So, and they're they just live up in there with the ColourPop for the moment being. Okay, so now we're going to start with this rainbow storage. I'm not quite sure where it came from. My boyfriend's parents got it for me for my um, birthday, but I believe it was like. Macy? Hmm. I believe it was like $25. So it's not bad for a storage. Macy! Who even knows? Okay, so this first drawer, I have my primers, concealers, setting sprays, color correcting, and foundation stuff. All stays up in here. This basket has, um, all that I mentioned first and these are just my foundations that I have at the moment from this is Maybelline Maybelline I have a lot of Maybelline I like I love Maybelline um I have some wet and wild back there I have covergirl um I don't even know really but I have quite a few and then I have my L'Oreal foundation I absolutely love this like I love it I just recently got this and I'm in love already with this and then I have my Maybelline fit me back here this is new this is the um dewy plus smooth I'm excited to try it out but that's everything that is in this first drawer my second drawer has a lot of random and quite a few of just a little bit of everything um I got this in my ipsy bag is a single highlight I have my wet and wild highlight this is my favorite loose powder at the moment. I have a Maybelline Fit Me powder. I have my Wet n Wild bronzer, Milani blush. These, there's three right here. They came in my Ipsy. That came in my Ipsy. I just recently 
got this my cover fx drops i'm so excited to try it out and i have my hula bronzer and then this basket right here just has a little bit of everything in it that i don't really use but i do use but just not on the regular so it just stays in the basket my third drawer is like single eyeshadows i have my um three ColourPop here. I actually ordered a magnetic palette from Ulta. It should be here either tomorrow or Friday. I have my glitters. Um, these are just like loose shadows. I have Revlon, Hikari, NYX. This came in my Ipsy. I'm excited to try it out. I have my cream eye pencil. And I just have a, like a few randoms just back there. And then I have two hard candy palettes. I have a CoverGirl and then a little Maybelline. I don't really use these but I use a few of these and I definitely I use these too I haven't used this one yet my third drawer is like eye stuff um I have these like lip glosses here I don't really have nowhere to put them yet until I get another little storage right here but this is just what I store my lipsticks in at the moment I have some Milani and L'Oreal I have a CoverGirl and then three came from Ipsy, and then I have my mascara and eyeliners. I have a ColourPop, CoverGirl, Maybelline, and a Too Faced right there. My third drawer is my, well, these are my eyelash, eyelashes. I don't have a lot because I don't really wear them. I haven't really, like, tried wearing them, but I started out with another pair of these that I actually wore to a band banquet and then when I went to Houston, Texas, I wore them and I I really like them. They're like very natural but they're there and I actually like them. So I went and I bought these for more like glam makeup looks I guess you could say. But that's my little collection of eyelashes. I'm starting to grow them. Um, this next drawer is actually empty. I don't know what I'm going to put in here yet. It's just an empty drawer, so. And then this drawer is just my face mask. I absolutely love face mask. Um, I have them. I got a lot from Walmart and Walgreens, and then this, 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 and this came from my Ipsy, and then this came from the Lush store when I went to New Orleans. I found it. I found the Lush store, and I was like, yes. But they gave me a little sample of this. And then this next drawer is just boxes. I love boxes. So, that is this drawer. And then this next drawer, I keep my headbands in. Just when I want to pull my hair back when I do my makeup. So, that's that drawer. And then this bottom drawer, I keep my Ipsy bags in. But yeah, that is an overview. And a go-through of those little storage things right there so now moving on to my vanity I don't really have much on my vanity but that's what it looks like and then this mirror I believe came from Bath and Body Works yeah and then this vanity came from a flea market my parents got it for me for Christmas maybe like two years ago so and then over here I have all my brushes um, I keep my little sponges here, my oval brushes, my elf kabuki. That little brush has like some glitter in it. My little cousin loves it. I have all my like powder and face brushes. And then these are just like some other face brushes. I keep in that third one. And then my eyeshadow brushes. Underneath like this little shelf right here and this little white thing, these little boxes I actually went on it, but I didn't like it. So I took it out. I just have rent. I was like, I don't even know what it is. I don't even know, but I have my camera lens caps there. I have some Q-tips. Um, I have like a little outlet thing. Um, and that little box has some coins in it from like different countries. And then this little zebra thing, I have um, some little face sponges, some bobby pins, really, and a brush. That's really it. And then underneath, I have my little zebra garbage can. I'm obsessed with zebra stripes, so y'all will eventually learn that. And I'm obsessed with stuff from Paris. This little box has Paris on it, so. And then I have my Sephora bag. And then over here, this is like a little overview of this. I found this little acrylic shelf at a flea market. It was like three bucks, and I had to have it, so I bought it. 
I love flea marketing flea markets too so you can find some nice stuff this little black shelf can from a flea market so mm -hmm. but we're gonna start at the top here I have all my perfumes body sprays lotion and this in the back is my face cleaner or one of them and then the second shelf I'm sorry if you see the camera flinch too my hand is like twitching so <laughs> sorry about that but I have my Neutrogena face wipes I have Okay, that wasn't my hand that time. I accidentally hit my little tripod. But I have my coconut face oil. I, that came from the Lush. I have a Lush bath bomb. This is Victoria's Secret body bronzer. And in this shelf, I have my eyeshadow palettes. I have two from BH Cosmetics. I have two Naked 2 palettes. I have um, Modern Renaissance. I have my Kylie Burgundy palette. I have my Tarte palette in bloom I have my Saharan palette Nicole Guerrero and my sun dipped palette yeah those are all my palettes at the moment and my collection with those are steady growing so I'm very excited about that um this bottom shelf I have these little colorista hair things I was doing my little cousin's hair and I did mine blue I only did the blonde though because I have brown hair but now some scissors and then this little bitty thing I got it hey Macy come here and then I got that from Walmart. It just has like lip glosses, tweezers, lip butters. So just a little bit of everything up in there. And then that cookie jar has all my fingernail polishes up in it. And any kind of like fingernail stuff. So that's what I keep in there. And then right here I'm not even going to go through that black little box. My cousin organized it. And there's just like a bunch of random stuff. So you know as you can see. That little pink box my boyfriend got it for me for Christmas and it has some Laura Geller makeup in it so I was excited about that and then I have my camera tripod but that is an overview of my makeup collection organization slash storage I know it's not a big collection but I love my collection so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed looking at how I have everything set up. So I love you guys so much. So until next time, bye.